Well, uh, young lady, can you please tell me your name? My name is Melodia Kumba Akasmayowa. Melodia Kumba what? Akasmayowa. Where are you from? I'm from Osage. Ogun Osage local Osage. government. Please, how old are you? I am 16 years. 16 years. Wow. What class are you? I'm in SS3. Can you please tell me the name of your school, the school you attend? The name of my school is Victory Monday College, Tigara Abidu, Borside Uh, I heard about a case involving you and the current Commissioner for Environment, Honorable uh, Balogun Abdul. Can you please tell me, uh, can you just narrate a little about what transpired between you and the Honorable? What transpired between I and the um, Honorable is that on the 29th of December 2020, which is Tuesday. I was on my way to the NIN office to do my NIN. So I came across this man, named uh, Honorable Abiodun Abudu Balogu, which is the current commissioner for environment at the uh, motorcycle park. So he called me. I was discussing with my friend. He called me that he knows me somewhere, and I told him that I didn't know you. He said, okay, maybe I resemble the person that, where am I living? I told him that I'm living at Itaogun. Now I said, okay, I can take my leave. I left there. So when I wanted to leave the scene, he now sent uh, this guy named Sheung at the park to come and collect my phone number. And I told the guy that he should tell the honorable for the honorable that he should go and collect that my, my phone number from Mr. Lassisi Said, aka Mayo. That the guy now said, Okay, he's sorry that he may not know, he may not know that the man is my father, that he's the man my father. And I said, No, the man is not my father, but he's another brother to my father. And I said, Okay. They now well, started disturbing that my friend that we were discussing together to give them my phone number. The guy. Now, who was who, who was the person disturbing your friend? Mr. Austin, a, a teacher at Illusion Grammar School present. So the man was disturbing that my friend to release my number. So the guy now released my number to them. The uh, Mr. Austin now called me that where am I? I told him that I'm at the NIN office. That I want to register my NIN. Now I said, okay, I should come back. And I told him that I can't leave what I'm doing right now. Come and meet him. And I said, when I'm through, I should come and meet him at the Biade Park. And I said, okay, sir. So when I. Sorry, sorry. Who are you? Who did you suspect was sending uh, Austin to collect your number to speak with you? Abiyo, 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 Abiyo. All right. So uh, when I was through with the NIN, I went home uh, straight. Straight. So the uh, Mr. Austin now called me that night again. That why didn't I come and meet him at the park? And I said I was in a hurry to go home. That I have something to do at home. That's why I didn't come and meet him. And I said okay. So on the thirty first of December, twenty twenty, which is on Thursday again. A, a Mr. Lazisi Mayo now came to now went to go and meet my grandparents that he wanted to take me that someone need a computer operator that the man said i know how to operate computer so he now came to meet me and asked me that did i know how to operate computer and i told him yes that i know how to operate computer now i said okay that i should go and change my clothes that I should that we are going to meet someone that needs a computer operator and i said okay now i said so we now went together to the actions house on getting to the honorable abiodu abudu house at itao he now the, he said i should sit down inside the car that i must not get down and a lady now came to pick me whose by name is Miriam eniola oyenuga uh, from itao so the guy now took me inside one living room so the guy now, the austin mr austin now came inside and started the conversation with me that uh, why didn't I pick his call yesterday? And I told him that I was not with my phone. And I said, okay. He now took me to um, a room. 
uh, Mr. Ondi, honorable, inside whose house? Inside Honorable Abiodun Abubu okay. So, the Honorable Abiodun Abubu Balogun now came inside, and Mr. Austin went outside immediately. So, immediately Mr. Austin went out. The uh, Honorable Abiodun Abubu Balogun locked the door instantly and put the key inside his pocket. So, you now. He now moved closer to me and asked for the name of my school. I told him that I'm from Victory Model College. He said, uh, how much uh, is my school fees? I told him that it's 30,000 naira. He asked me for, he asked the person that is paying my school fees. I told him that it's my dad. He now said, okay, that one is too much. So, he now said, didn't I think of uh, starting a business before going to school? And I said, no, that I want to, I want to go to an higher institution. And I said, okay, da. If I would need money now, how much should I need? And I said, any amount. He said, I should state an amount. I said, any amount. He now move closer to me and press my breast. And I'll move away his hand. Down. You mean, uh, Honorable uh, Balogun, the current commissioner for environment, moved and touched your breast? Yes, sir. Okay. He touched my breast, so I moved away his hand that he shouldn't touch my breast. He said, he now has me that won't I cooperate? I said, why will I cooperate? So he now started pressing my breast, pressing my body, and asking me something like that. And what were you doing that time? I was struggling to free myself from him, to gain freedom. So he now started reciting some incantations. I wanted to place his hand on my head. I now moved away his hand that he shouldn't touch my head. That they don't use to touch my head. He now wanted to force me inside his bedroom. But I struggled with him and started shouting. Uh, because uh, people are around his compound and he didn't want them to know what is happening. He now let he now leave me there. He now gave me uh, four five hundred naira notes, which is two thousand naira that I should use it as my transport. I rejected money that I didn't need it. He now said if I didn't collect the money that I won't let go of me. So I now collected the five hundred naira four five hundred naira notes from him. And he now opened the door for me. And I went out of his house. He now told that Mr. Austin to take me to our house. Okay. Now what you with all this, with all the stories uh you have narrated, what do you want Nigerians to do about this matter? As as a young as a teenager, sixteen years old, who was harassed uh, by a sitting commissioner, commissioner for environment in Ogun State. What do you want Nigerians to do about this matter to you? Because I can see uh, how you feel, and I want you in that passion to tell Nigerians what you want. I want a meaningful Nigerians to help me to take up this matter and help me to. A charge against him because I, this has never happened to me in my life. Right now, I'm I'm so shocked. As in, it has never happened to me. They have never harassed me in that manner. So I want meaningful Nigerians to help to help me on this matter. Please.